Good afternoon. I'm Senator Kelda Royce, and I'm the proud parent of three young kids and two stepkids that I've already raised. In the two months since the state budget has passed, with zero funding for child care counts, we have heard from dozens of centers all around the state that they are having to close their doors because they cannot financially operate. And there are probably many more closures that we haven't even heard of. This is not because we don't have the money. We have $4 billion still left over from our historic surplus. It's not because we don't have a need. In fact, the biggest challenge facing our state is the workforce shortage and the fact that young people are leaving in droves. We cannot solve our workforce shortage by taking more workers out of the workforce, which is what happens when child care centers close. Every few thousand dollars of child care counts helps parents be in the workforce and generates tens or hundreds of thousands of dollars in economic activity. So we even get paid back faster than Caitlin mentioned. Yesterday in the state capitol, Republicans held a hearing on a bunch of sham anti-choice bills doubling down on their strategy to ban abortion. And I don't know how you can call yourself pro-life when you devalue the people who nurture the life. When you say no to paid family leave. <laughs> Wisconsin is a terrible place to have a baby when you consider the developed world. Our infant mortality rates, our maternal mortality rates are absolutely unacceptable. And imagine, there's so much worse if you're a person of color. We actually have the worst in the nation for black and indigenous women. How can you call yourself pro-life if you say no to paid family leave, knowing that that will drastically reduce our infant maternal mortality rates?